welcome to Watch Symposium. I'm Austin. Gray market dealers are putting a freeze on buying. So I've got a friend in the States. He sent me an email earlier and he called around. He was looking to sell one of his pieces. And according to him, a few places, more than a few, are putting a freeze on buying. One place in particular said, we're, we're, not, we're not buying pieces right now, but check back next week. All right, so in this whole retail gray market buying and selling system, when there's a breakdown, the whole thing can come to a screeching stop. And so where is the breakdown? Well, according to my friend, this place had bought a bunch of pieces, all right? So if they had customers waiting to buy them, or if they thought that they would be selling them pretty quickly, then they'd probably wanna buy my friend's piece. So it tells me that there are not a lot of uh, customers out there. If there were, I'm sure this gray market dealer would start buying them. So if gray market dealers stop buying, flippers are gonna get these pieces and, and have to sit on them, and that's when things can come to a screeching halt. I've also heard reports of sales and flash sales and up to 20% off on pretty hot models. So that's another indication that customers really uh, aren't there, and so this could be a sign that we're seeing the start of something. Now it's worth keeping in mind that there's a Rolex food chain at the very top. You've got the Daytonas, the GMT is a little lower than that. You've got the subs. It goes all the way down to the diamond dial two-tone date just. And here in Japan, you can get the diamond dial two-tone date just, but you cannot get the two-tone date justs without diamonds, all right? So still those are the lowest on the food chain, that and say a steel date just. Again, you can't get those either. If you start seeing those pop up at authorized dealers, that's a huge sign. And if this continues, you'll see more and more of those pieces you otherwise couldn't have gotten a couple months ago start to appear. And it's gonna appear from the bottom of the food chain on up. Now, will we ever see Daytonas and subs and GMTs? That's gonna take a long time. I don't think it's gonna get that bad. But if you start seeing some of those new steel date justs with the cool dials, all right, that's a sign. Let me know if you do. So there you go, let me know what you think. By the way, did you know that Rolex makes 800 to a million watches a year and those are gonna be coming into the market. So the gray market is going to have to keep that in mind. Let me know what you think. Take care, thanks for watching. See you next time.